life's disappointments are inevitable. The only thing you can control is how you react to them. I worked a sales deal one time for an entire year I flew into another city and spent time and energy winning that deal. It was a $350 million deal and there was so much effort put into it. And in order to get to that city, I had to fly into another city and then connect on one of those small little planes. And I went back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And I had met with leadership uh, and talked to them about this deal. All was good. I had all yeses. And as I moved forward and got board level approval from the company for the, for the purchase, I was excited. I thought, wow, this is going to happen. All my efforts are paying off. This is amazing. A year away from my kids and my family as I traveled back and forth. And I brought the deal back to the company after it was approved at the board level. And the company decided at the last minute not to do the deal. And I said, what? You gave me approval to go after this deal. You sent me there back and forth for a year and you're gonna back out now? Now? You're gonna back out now? I couldn't believe it. I felt like I had had the wind knocked out of me. And then I fell into a very deep sadness. I realized that all of this effort I'd expended was gone and that I could get it back and I wasn't going to be paid for the deal. I crawled into bed and I spent three days in bed. I couldn't get up. I didn't make breakfast for the kids. I didn't do anything. I just sort of recovered and finally crawled out of bed on day three and decided I needed a new plan. The first thing I knew is I did not want to work for a company that sent me somewhere for a year only to change their minds. So I knew I had to look and go out on a job search. And from there, I could sit down and put together some tactical action items to move me forward. You're going to run into disappointment and that disappointment does not have to define you. It can help you set a new path and a new road. You'll go through a lull as you deal with the disappointment, and then you need to pull yourself out of it and rebound. I have recovered. I still think about that deal that I spent a year on, but I also very, very closely evaluate my efforts and continually make sure that I'm going down the right path. I hope you have a fabulous day.